Uh, we're getting closer to the high, so the breeze is dying down. We've got puffy cumulus clouds and a much lighter breeze than we've had the last couple days. Um, the waves are a lot smaller. The last couple days we've been running in you know 20 plus knots and putting up pretty nice speeds and surfing down some pretty nice sized waves. And now the uh, ocean's flattened out and breeze is breeze is laying down. So change of scenery, but um, means we're progressing toward Newport. Really, I think I. I enjoy as I'm sure most people do the the heavy air downwind um, sailing driving in those conditions is is really fun and it's uh, feels a lot like surfing in some ways um, I do a lot of open water kayaking actually and uh, I think the crossover there is is quite similar so it's all about connecting the angles and you're actually watching the waves a lot more than you are the sails or the numbers whereas in uh, conditions like these it's it's all about watching the numbers a bit closer and uh, trying to minimize your movements the boats have a polar curve, which is essentially a projection of uh, the boat's performance at every given wind angle and wind speed crossover. And uh, we have uh, on this display actually a, uh, a readout of what our polar percentage is, so how the boat right in the second is performing relative to how it should be performing. And uh, it's, it's a way for us to grade how we're going, um, how we're sailing the boat well, and uh, if we're sailing the boat well. And, uh, if not, you know, it basically means we need to change or do something better.